like damn who give me some food for thought changing the pasta you had in your heart hey what's going on what's going on it's your boy tyrell clemens i'm here with my beautiful wife miss wendy and it's time for to give you a breakfast for your soul your food for thought wendy 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 what do you got for them this morning girl well today's quote says <clears throat> The most common way people give up their power is by thinking they don't have any. Mm, say that That's thing by Miss Alice Walker. Oh, I like it. I like it. Say it one more time. The most common way people give up their power mm -hmm. is by thinking they don't have any. They give up their power by thinking they don't have any. Now, I don't know who this message is for today. But, you know, uh, we, we get these messages and these quotes and we don't know who they're for, but I know this is for somebody. Somebody right now is walking around right now thinking that they are powerless. They're, they're walking around feeling like they don't have what it takes. They're not good enough to accomplish this. They're not strong enough to make this happen. They're not quick enough. They're, they're, they're not powerful enough. They're, they, don't, they don't have it. They don't have what it takes. A lot of y'all are walking around right now with that mindset. They don't have enough. I don't have enough to get it done. Mm -hmm. But what, what I want you to get in your head this morning is, is you need to understand a lot of times the biggest way you give up your power, the biggest way you give up your strength is by realizing or, or failing to realize how powerful you really are. You are powerful beyond measure. I'm you just say, I'm powerful. Uh, you you got to realize you're powerful. You're more powerful than you ever realize. You have more potential than you ever realize. You are powerful. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, if you don't understand, if you don't believe, if you don't acknowledge the fact that you have power, you ain't worth nothing. It, it, you you, you got to realize that your power is there, but unless you believe and understand that your power is there, you can't do it. You don't realize how much you can accomplish if you just simply believe it's, that you have enough to make it happen. It's kind of like um, your house. Uh -huh. You have several power outlets in the house that can give out power, uh -huh. but if you never plug the thing into it, they'll never light up, they'll never turn on, they'll never have power coming to them. So if you never plug in or plug into their power source and within you, you'll never have that power. The power is there, like well, she said, the power is there. But unless you actually take advantage of that power by plugging in, you won't get nothing accomplished. You will be in the dark unless you plug into the power source that's within inside you, that's within you. You have power within you. Greatness is within you, but a lot of folks don't take advantage of it because they don't know. They don't realize. Let me tell you a quick story. It's embarrassing. I'm gonna say it real quick. All right, then Wendy, you probably know what it is. Uh, what a, a few, few, uh, a little while ago, we went to our house one day, and it, it was after work, and I had the girls, and all of a sudden, um, they went in the house and they turned the light, but but the light didn't come on because I forgot to pay the bill. And it was dark, and I'm sitting here like, "Oh Lord, have mercy! I ain't paid the bill." I'm so, uh, so I'm sitting here calling folks up, and, and I finally got the bill paid. But, but weeks later, and this is a long time later, my daughters kept walking, kept walking in the house, and said, "Daddy, are the lights gonna come on?" Are the lights going to come on? I paid the bills. I had the power. But they didn't realize. They didn't understand that the power was there. So they had fear. And what I want you to understand, you have power. I know it might didn't work out the first time you tried it or the second time you tried it. But look, you have power. You just need to go flip that switch. You have the, what it takes. You just need to flip that switch. You got to be willing to go out there. The most powerful thing that you can do is to believe that you can actually achieve. If you don't have that belief with inside you, you're giving up your biggest power. Believe you're successful. Believe that you have what it takes. Believe you can accomplish these things that you set your mind for. Believe it. And the reason you can believe it is because you have the ultimate powerful source with you at the top. Look up. You got him. He's within you. And if you plug into him, you already got him. Greater is he that is within me than he that's within the world. Look, it's already inside you. He has an inside, it's inside you. The Holy Spirit, God's power is inside you, but you must take advantage of it. A lot of folks are scared to accomplish things because they're not taking advantage of the power source. The power source is there. Take advantage of it, and I guarantee you'll be successful. Well, that is your first for your soul, your food for thought. Hey, oh, okay, go, go, hit go, go, go hit subscribe. Subscribe. Do, what we're doing. Thank Do you. it now. Mm -hmm. Like it. No, I'm kidding. <laughs>
Instant clip, instant clip.